Hey, hello everyone. So I just got a box and looking through, uh, trying to weigh them. Found a few, maybe 10 or so, a little bit more that have uh, 226 grams plus. But I did find a proof ender right in the middle almost. Looks like it's going to be a 78. That's a nice start. I haven't opened up one roll yet. So we'll get to that. So these are rolling, yeah, weighing a little heavier. So let's see if there's anything in here. There's no guarantee that it's going to be silver, even though it's heavier. So I don't see any right there. Not even a proof. So we'll bring you back when I find something. Okay. I've opened several rolls. I think I'm on number six. I got four left that are heavier. That sure looks like a proof. Got one already. Found this um, eyeglass <laughs> 325 sticker for eyesight. But let's take a look. This could be, could be. Oh, yeah. What? That's a 2018. That's cool. If we're getting focused, you can see it too. Come on. I don't think I've ever had a after 2011. Wow. That'll go in the book. Nice looking 2018. And that's a 78. So hopefully there are some more proofs in here. I don't see another one here. Sometimes these wide ones are just not proofs. But that definitely had a S sticker or S uh, mint mark on it. We'll keep looking. Well, we are having some good proofs here, it looks like. I'm pretty sure that's going to be a proof. It is. And another 2018. Why couldn't it be a 2017? <laughs> I do have a, a book with all my proofs. Come on. There it is. A little bit scratched up, but not bad. Just little markings. So that's three proofs already. Let's keep looking. Well, I still have uh, 32 rolls left, and I think we got another proof here. And in between, I did find this 1971 golden paint job. A bit worn out. I wonder how wonderful it looked when it was fresh. Freshly made. So this has got to be a proof, right? Oh, it is. And it's not a 2018, but it's a 2013. This could be a little bit of a collection. All right, let's keep going. I hope to fill up my book then. I don't have very many in the last 10, 15 years. They almost all go back to the 80s and 90s. But I do have a bunch of 90s I don't have, so... Hopefully we'll find some tonight. Here we go. The very next roll. Looks like a 2023 and a proof next to it. I do believe. Okay. It is. And it's a 1989. That's cool. Year of one of my daughter's uh, birth year. 1989. Whoops. So that'll be nice for a birth year set. Good deal. All right, we'll keep on looking. Got 31 to go. All right, I've only got three rolls left, but I think I have another proof. It's pretty wide. It's in good shape. Oh, but it's not a proof. It's a D mint mark, so it's a Denver mint mark from the same year as this proof, the 89. But it's just a regular strike. Proofs are, uh, yeah, specially uh, put in by hand and stamped twice or something, and definitely a nicer finish to them. But that is not so. All right, we'll keep looking. Yeah. Well, I went through all fifty rolls. This is what I found. There's a couple marked up. Half dollars. 
five proofs. I got one at the end of this roll. Yeah, I'll take some photos of that and then I'll open it up. But here's a 2015 regular strike and definitely proofs on this side 89 2013 and two 2018s along with the 78 so that's a total of five proofs i'm happy with that i run into some coin not coin dealers but metal uh, gold buyers that think that's a proof because it's nice looking but that's it Thanks for watching.